Hello, I hope you're having a great day today. In my eight minute video, I am going to marinate a family sized pack of chicken breasts I purchased at a local grocery store with rotisserie seasoning. Feel free to use any seasoning of your choice. Let's start by slicing these beautiful custard meats. Please be sure that your knife is very sharp and wear gloves when handling any raw meat. I hope you don't mind while I'm cutting up these chickens here. I like to throw in a few chicken jokes. So, here we go. What do you call a mischievous egg? A practical yoker. <laughs> Joke number two. Did you hear about the chicken that only laid eggs in the winter? She was no spring chicken. What days do chickens hate the most? Friday. <laughs> what do you get if a chicken lays an egg on top of a barn? An egg roll. Why did the chicken cross the road twice? He was a double crosser. By the way, don't forget to remove the skins. Why don't chickens like people? Because they beat eggs. I know, I know. Stick to my cooking, right? I'm no comedian. So now that we got all of these uh, chicken sliced up, uh, I'm going to save about half chicken breast. The other half I'm going to slice into strips or chicken tenders. If you like my video, please smash that like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. I really appreciate it. And thanks for spending your time here, your valuable time here with me watching my videos. Let's go ahead and speed up this footage to save video time. Finally, it is time to mix our chicken strips with our seasoning. In a round mixing bowl, let's incorporate these two together and make sure it is evenly coated. Let's go ahead and speed up this footage to save video time. The finale is here. Now it is time to go ahead and put these into a plastic one gallon bag for storage. I recommend putting it in the refrigerator for about 48 hours up to 72 hours before you decide to freeze it.
And now for the chicken breast, let's do the same thing in the same mixing bowl. Let's go ahead and combine these two together and give it a good mix, a massage with your hands, fork, knife, spoon, whatever. Let's make sure it is evenly coated. Let's go ahead and speed up this footage to save video time. In between videos, I do wash my hands before I handle a different product or different item. This is my chicken breast with rotisserie seasoning pan fried. Slow simmer. Again, as always, thank you so much for spending your valuable time here with me watching my video. I would appreciate it if you smash the like button and subscribe to my channel. And I hope uh, you look forward to my next video. See you soon.